Decisions, decisions. That is the focus of today's real estate rundown with Remax Icon. We've got broker owner Michael Patterson joining us now with more. How are you? I'm great, Elsa. Good to see you. Good to see you too. You know, I'm one of those people, my mind goes a million ways and I think of every case scenario. So I have to ask you, is it better right now to renovate our home or sell it and just buy a new one without going through all of that? So it really depends on what your goals are in terms of, you know, do you like your location? What are you trying to do for it? What is it that you don't like about your home? You know, through uh, the pandemic, we spent more time in our home. So a lot of us have been looking at things and deciding, you know, do I not like my home? Do I like it? What should I do to it? And it is a big, a big conversation currently as to whether to renovate and or whether to sell it. So in real estate, it's always location, location, location. So if you, you know, if you love your, your community, you love where you live, uh, depending on what you want to do for your home, it might make sense to renovate your home and stay there. It really is a cost thing. So one thing you have to be very careful of if you do a renovation is that you don't over improve your property for the neighborhood that you're in, right? So in general, you, you prefer not to be the most expensive home in the neighborhood. Uh, you want to be more of the, the middle ground or even a little bit less because that continues to drive your value up. So you do have to be careful about how much money you put into it. So as an example, recently, you know, someone had talked about, you know, finishing their basement in order to sell their home and finishing a basement is very expensive. It can be somewhere between 30 and $50,000 to do so. And in many cases, again, depending on the neighborhood, the community, you might be able to uh, get a little bit of that back, but you're not going to get a dollar for dollar return. You're not going to get 50,000 added on to your sales price. So you do have to look at what you're doing and you should always consult with a real estate professional first and they can give you the best advice, what to renovate, how to renovate, and talk about should you buy a new home and sell this one or whether it's better to renovate. Well, I've got, I have a real estate professional right in front of me, so I can ask you my next question. <laughs> if we are going to renovate, what areas of our home should we tackle first? If it's, if it's not the basement, where should we be? Bathrooms and kitchens. Makes Bathrooms sense. and kitchens sell houses. I agree. I'm glad I'm right. Thank you. <laughs> Those are the selling points. Tell us about your upcoming home buyer webinar, because I think that's going to really illuminate a lot of these uh, questions and issues that we have around real estate right now. Right. So, yeah. So we host a virtual home buyer webinar every month. Our next one comes up on Saturday, February the 12th. And I'd love for you know anyone interested, even if you own a home, it's not a first time home buyer seminar. It's a home buyer seminar. So we talk about the market. We talk about all the differences that are happening and to be competitive in a low inventory market. You know, do you have to pay over list price? Do you waive the appraisal contingency? You know, what about inspections? You know, what about cash offers? Lots of things that's going on, you know, based on our current market. So we walk through that. We also include in that our, our partners, which we have an in-house uh, mortgage company and an in-house title company. And so they're, they're, they're on the call as well with us. They're on the virtual webinar. So it does give you a chance to chat with, you know, an attorney about real estate as well as a, a lender about financing. So it's a great opportunity to learn about the home buying process. In addition to our, our those companies, we have a, a property management company mm -hmm. uh, and soon we'll be launching a, a new consumer portal. So be on the lookout for uh, your home hub, which will be everything real estate, all in a, a consumer dashboard for anyone who uh, owns a home. I love that you make it easy for us. We've got so many things going on. I like that that is just a straightforward way to get it done. Tell us about, um, also, you have a special offer for Midday Maryland viewers. We don't want to miss that. That's right. We love our Midday Maryland viewers. So uh, anytime that you buy or sell a home, the Remax icon, just mention Midday Maryland, and we'll give you a complimentary free home warranty. All right. That's a big deal, that free home warranty. We appreciate it, Michael Patterson. Appreciate you being here. And we'll be right back with more Midday Maryland right after this. Stay tuned.